Hello beloved wild era friends, gorillas are giant and quite gentle animals. They exhibit many actions and emotions similar to humans, including laughter and sadness. In fact, Gorlason humans share 98% of their genetic makeup. They are very closely related to humans, second only to chimpanzees. Gorillas have robust bodies with broad chests and shoulders, large hands resembling human hands, and small eyes without fur. They are the largest and strongest among the great apes. Gorillas live in tropical and subtropical forests of Africa. There are two species of gorillas today. Mountain gorillas, which are very dangerous, live in forests on the Albertine Rift Mountains, ranging from 2,225 to 4,267 meters high in the Virunga Range in East Africa. The second species is lowland gorillas, which live in dense forests and marshes in areas near sea level. Gorillas live in troops of 5 to 10 individuals, but they can range from 20 to over 50 individuals per troop, dominated by a mature male, also known as a silverback gorilla. This male maintains his position for many years. Males weigh twice as much as females and can reach a height of about 5.5 feet, equivalent to 1.7 meters, and weigh from 300 to 485 pounds, equivalent to 135 to 220 kilograms. And now, here are the top 6 animals that can defeat a silverback gorilla. Top 6 Lion Both lions and gorillas have their own strengths and weaknesses. The large fangs of gorillas are designed more for intimidation than for tearing flesh, and they are still duller compared to the hunting functions of their adversary, which is the male lion. If a lion is at its maximum size, it will be very difficult for a gorilla to have any impact on the lion's neck because they have a mane to protect them. Lions don't rely solely on their bite. While it is unlikely that a lion could kill a gorilla with its bite alone, it could still happen. A gorilla's silverback neck is well protected. However, many forget that while grappling with another animal, these large cats tend to use their hind claws to completely disembowel anything in front of them. They can do this very quickly and cause significant damage without a doubt when a lion could kill a gorilla this way. Or the lion will grapple with the gorilla and quickly disembowel it with its hind legs while attempting to bite into its lower jaw or trying to bite deep into the gorilla's neck from behind and paralyze it. Let's compare the biting force of these two species. First, the gorilla. Gorillas are one of the strongest biting primates. Some studies estimate that gorillas can have a bite force of up to 1,300 pound force pounds per square inch or about 5,700 newtons. This is quite a strong bite force. What about its opponent? You will find out right now. The lion, some studies and estimates show that the bite force of a lion can reach about 600 pound force or approximately 2,700 newtons. This is a very impressive figure, showing the powerful hunting ability of lions. So the bite force of lions is relatively weak compared to their opponent. In terms of biting force, gorillas are stronger and more powerful, however, Lion fangs are longer and, as lions are carnivorous, their fighting experience is richer and more resilient. Therefore, I think it depends on who is faster, then who wins. So I would like to say that they are evenly matched with a 50-50 chance. Both lions and gorillas can win in this battle. Top 5 Grizzly Bear The North American grizzly bear weighs three times more than a gorilla, although both are the largest in nature. However, the gorilla's higher muscle mass doesn't necessarily mean it would win. Grizzly bears don't hunt often, but when they do, they can kill prey much larger than a gorilla, such as a large moose. The advantage of bears over gorillas is their large claws, while gorillas try to use their hands to beat prey to death. The giant claws of the bear will cut into the flesh of the gorilla, Gorillas may be smarter, but in a fight, size and muscle often prioritize over brain power. Gorillas now have significantly stronger bites. Supported by their massive teeth, the bear's fangs are also larger, and its bite can easily kill a gorilla, so the gorilla's jaws don't have much advantage. 
If we are talking about a larger grizzly bear or a larger polar bear than a gorilla, it will surely have the upper hand and will win against a gorilla. However, if we are talking about a grizzly bear the same size as a gorilla, it is very likely that the gorilla will win in this battle. Gorillas can run at speeds of up to 35 to 40 kilometers per hour, approximately 20 to, to 25 miles per hour. This is a very impressive speed, allowing them to move quickly among tree branches. The specific speed of the grizzly bear can reach from about 30 to 40 kilometers per hour, approximately 18 to 25 miles per hour. So in terms of speed and strength, if both animals are the same size, the gorilla will have the advantage over the bear. Top 4 Nile Crocodile In this clash, the crocodile is likely to win because they are much larger, up to 2 or 3 times the size of a silverback gorilla. This is especially true when we talk about saltwater crocodiles and Nile crocodiles. Furthermore, the bite force of a crocodile is the strongest ever recorded, at 3,700 side pounds per square inch on each square inch. All it has to do is bite the gorilla and drag it into the water. Gorillas tend to fight by striking and tearing with their hands and feet, but the thick skin and body structure of the crocodile, especially in the water, will help it survive any impact or attempt to rip its limbs apart. Nile crocodiles, the second largest species in the world, are known to prey on much larger animals than gorillas. Crocodiles can engage both on land and in water, with water being their stronger territory. Crocodiles are known for their strength, vicious bites, and dominance. The Nile crocodile Crocodilus niloticus is one of the largest crocodile species in the world and typically has impressive sizes. The average length of a Nile crocodile ranges from 4 to 5 meters approximately 13 to 16 feet. However, the largest individuals can reach up to 6 meters about 20 feet or more. Nile crocodiles use the ambush technique by waiting for prey near or underwater, then suddenly attacking from their hiding spot. They can also handle large prey by dragging it down to the river or lake bottom. Nile crocodiles can eat almost anything, from fish, frogs, and even large animals like antelopes and small mammals. They also prey on cattle, buffalo, and even humans in rare cases. Top 3. Hippo On land, hippos can easily dispatch a gorilla without much effort. While underwater, they can also dispatch a crocodile quite effortlessly. A single hippo can measure up to 16.5 feet 5.2 meters long, stand 5 feet 1.5 meters tall, and weigh 9,000 pounds for 1,080 to kilograms. A hippo is much larger than a gorilla, up to 10 times bigger, due to its large size, thick muscles, and abundant fat, making it extremely difficult to kill. Besides the size difference, hippos also have a thick layer of specialized fat acting as armor against the sharp teeth of gorillas. Entire prides of lions have been chased away by hippos in the past. We can draw a comparison with smaller cheetahs that have killed gorillas in rare combat situations. Hippos are also known to prey on larger animals than gorillas. In addition to lions, they also kill Nile crocodiles, which are twice the size of gorillas. Hippos can easily kill a gorilla because they have much larger teeth and one of the strongest bites of any land animal, which supports their ability to both trample and crush gorillas, while the strength of gorillas may help. A hippo being too large for a gorilla's muscles to contend with is an insurmountable problem. The only advantage gorillas have over hippos may be their intelligence, although I doubt that intelligence would be of much use to a gorilla in combat against a hippo. Gorillas are quite intelligent, who knows? Maybe they'll use a stick to beat the hippo and run away. Just kidding, if a battle were to occur, the gorilla would be swiftly killed by the hippo. The reason I say this is because even the king of the savanna, the lion, has to give way when encountering a hippo. If a hippo can face off against a rhinoceros, then why would it lose to a gorilla? Top 2. Giraffe Giraffes in combat by swinging their necks at each other as if they were in a giant wrestling match. Sometimes, lions attack giraffes and emerge victorious, but more often than not, 
the giraffe's powerful kicks can knock out or even kill the lion. A gorilla can quickly climb onto the legs and neck of a giraffe and cause it to suffocate, but it would be extremely challenging. An adult giraffe outweighs a silverback gorilla from 7 to 10 times, and it can kick a gorilla away easily. A giraffe can weigh up to a maximum of 4,250 pounds, equivalent to 1,930 kilograms, and then its size and strength are much superior to that of a gorilla. A headbit from a giraffe equipped with horns and a kick can be lethal. Humans have been killed in this manner. Giraffes can easily defeat gorillas, and I believe a simple headbit or kick from a giraffe would be enough to send a gorilla to its demise. But gorillas are not passive creatures, they can grab onto the legs of a giraffe and use their strength to make it fall and injure it. They can also utilize their powerful and mighty punches to strike the giraffe's face and lead to the gorilla's victory. I'm talking about if it's a small giraffe or one the same size as a gorilla. If it's fully grown, just one kick would send the gorilla running for its life. Gorillas, with their humble height, have to look up at giraffes. When a giraffe headbutts, it can knock the gorilla off guard without even realizing it. Top 1. Cybelira Tiger In the reigning position of our video today are the elder siblings of domestic tiger cats, the Siberian Tiger, and the silverback gorilla, both kings of their own environments. They are large, powerful, and intelligent animals. The Siberian tiger is the largest cat species. They are very agile and move with high-speed agility. They possess a robust body, large muscles, a massive jaw, and strong, dagger-like fangs that are very long and sharp. Their claws can retract and curl tightly for a firm grip. Their weakness lies in their lighter weight, smaller size, and bulkiness compared to large gorillas. Their skin is not as thick as gorillas, and their endurance is also less. When a tiger attacks a gorilla, the gorilla is not an easy and safe target because the gorilla can deliver lethal blows to the tiger. Tigers have faster reaction times, longer and stronger claws, giant fangs, and good opportunistic biting force of 1050 PS I compared to gorillas. Moreover, their longer fangs, powerful physique, and thick fur are other advantages. I believe that thanks to the hunting nature of tigers, they can ambush and kill a gorilla easily. Meanwhile, tigers are innate hunters with good tactical skills and robust muscles, enabling them to quickly evade lethal bites or punches from gorillas. With their long claws, Tigers can stand on two legs and slap the gorilla's face directly, causing it injury or even death. So that's the end of the video on the top 6 animals that can defeat a gorilla. However, there is still much more content and room for improvement. We greatly appreciate your feedback and contributions. If you have any other opinions about today's content or suggestions for Wild Era, please leave a comment below the video. Thank you for your attention and support. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel for more exciting videos.